Uh, fumble I have to look at. Obviously, I got loose with it, had one hand on it. Should have two. If I have two, probably don't fumble it. Um, and then the interception, just bad decision. Um, throw it away, work for the next play. Yeah, that guy made a good play. I mean, he's playing center field, and he makes a play on the sideline. It's an aggressive play by him. Um, no, you know, traditionally, they're playing just a few coverages, not a, not a ton of different coverages. Um, you know, they're going to be aggressive within those schemes. They know it. And, um, you know, just got to make sure I do a good job of, you know, not letting them get it. How much was that a reflection of what your actual your game plan was coming in versus falling behind and having? Yeah, it was more score game uh, game flow oriented. Um, you know, you don't ever think about doing that into a game. You know, we were coming in with a, a balanced game plan, and obviously the the scoreboard got to where it was. Um, you know, we had to uh, try and do some things to to get back into it. How difficult is it to get started against the twelve yard line consistently throughout the, the entire game? I want to be. Uh, you know, further down the field than that, but sometimes games, uh, you know, don't happen that way. Um, I thought we did a nice job of getting them all out of there. I think, um, you know, didn't come away with points every time, but um, at least flipped the field for uh, a decent amount of those uh, to check on all. But um, you know, we shouldn't play well enough as offense. We didn't run the ball well enough. Defense probably didn't stop the run well enough. And you name it, um, we didn't do it well enough. Describe the up and down from week in and week out in the NFL. It looks like two weeks ago you guys are starting to trend upwards, and then a game of flat like this happens. How do you describe the? You gotta prove it every week, um, and every team is a good team. You know, it doesn't matter uh, who you're playing. You gotta go out there and, and prove it and play well. Um, if you don't play well, you won't win. If you play well, you win. Um, you know, and, and that's just. I know you always gonna kind of play the match. I'm just wondering if he's seeing different coverage looks after his strong start. No, no. I mean, these guys were uh, playing their stuff. Um, you know, and it just just happened that uh, other guys caught the ball. Um, there really was no, you know, thought anywhere. We don't really go into a week thinking throw this guy a ball a bunch of times and nobody else the ball. We just go out there and call plays, and it's on, you know, on me to make sure I get it to the right guy. We talked about circumstances. Did you even feel like you had the ball in the first half? I think you guys had like two and a half possessions, and that was it. Yeah, it was um, a little bit of a funky game from a time of possession, um, but. You know, normally when that happens in the first half, you flip it in the second half, you get the ball a bunch. I don't know what the numbers, you know, ended up being, but uh, we didn't control the game. You know, we didn't um, convert enough on third downs and, and, you know, keep our defense off the field and, and vice versa. You took some, some big hits at the, the end of that, including your hand got jammed up. How are you feeling? Okay. Yeah, I'll be all right. Good morning, guys. That, uh, you know, responding to a loss like this is a lot of people will be writing off again. They were writing off earlier. Um, is this team a little bit different responding to it at the times that you've been here? They haven't. Um, you know, I think uh, we just got to go out there and, you know, dive into our next opponent. Obviously, you got a bunch of big games coming up. Um, and uh, you got to do everything we can to make sure we're prepared. Um, we come in the building on Wednesday, ready to go to work, and um, go out there and try and get a win next week. Thanks, guys.